Welcome back to my channel. So in today's video, we are going to be testing out the Huda Beauty original and, and the new foundation that she just launched. Now I want to do this for myself because I want to see if both of those foundation is the same. If you guys missed my last video testing out the new foundation, I will put it up right here so you guys could take a look at that foundation. Now in my previous video, I liked it. I like the coverage. It feels the same as the original to me. I don't think I prepped my skin good for that foundation. My skin was a little tight. I want to try it out doing my original step when I'm preparing to try out a new matte foundation. So I have both of this foundation here. So this is the original and this is the new luminous matte foundation. Now I do like it, but I want to point out to you guys, the shade do look different in the bottle. If you guys can see the original is a little bit more on the right side and this look more on the cool side. I don't even know girl. Okay. So the luminous foundation is $40. Uh, it's available on Huda Beauty website and Sephora and it's full coverage. The original is, is a matte foundation and it's also 24 hours wear. So in the last video, I, I tried it out with the Huda Beauty primer. Now I really do like this primer. So this is the reason why I tried it out, but I don't think it has anything to do with the primer. I think it's the foundation. The foundation was a little too matte for me. So I'm going to go in with my pretty fresh primer. This is from ColourPop. Now, when I tried out the last foundation, like the new one, it gives me a nice coverage, okay? Like coverage is like really, really good. But I just wanna try both of them out because if both of them perform the same, I don't need two of them, I honestly don't. Just like trying all of these out, I still prefer the foundation stick for dry skin. I think this is like really good for dry skin. So hopefully that this live up to her name girl. I really didn't want to use this in this video, but I'm going to put a little bit of the Charlotte Tilbury. I actually just got this and this is a flawless filter youth glow. And this is for dry skin. I just want to see how it works for my skin first. And then if I like it, then I'll buy the bigger bottle, but this is the, the mini size. And this is the shade 6.5 deep. So this is a Hollywood flawless filter. I think this shade works really good. Now I was going for seven, but seven is like too dark. So this is a perfect time to use this because girl, this foundation is really matte. Okay. So this really gives me a nice shine, but everything is going to blend out better. So it doesn't matter. Now this Charlotte Tilbury stuff is good. So we're going to try out the original first. I don't know what happened to my pump. I can't get it out. I haven't used this in a year, okay? This been out for a while. So I'm just gonna open it up. So I'm gonna take it and put on this side first. So you guys can see the undertone. So this is the original. So I just want you guys to see the shade. So girl, if you have to use this, you need to prep your skin really good because this is a very matte foundation. In my last video, my face feels so tight. And I can't even smell the, the fragrance in with the original because I forgot the way it smelled. But I remember when I used it the first time, it was really strong, but I'm not even, can't even smell it. I'm going to use my same brush from the last video because I still have foundation on that. I'm going to go in with the new one. As you guys can see in the bottle, I just want to point that out again. Both of them on the tones are like different. We're going to go in on this side. As you guys see the shade. Okay, so we have both of them on our skin girl and this is the original and this is the new one. Now I'm seeing a difference now, but I wanted to oxidize a little bit 
so I could see if it if both of the shades gonna look the same but for now this has a little bit more a yellow undertone and this one is more red okay I like the way it feels now because girl if you have dry skin please go and get this from Charlotte Tilbury like this is crazy like dewy I love this I'm gonna be using this a lot because I feel like my face feels so much better I'm happy I didn't use it because I wouldn't have known how, how the foundation works on my skin so I'm happy I did that but I love this so let me just come up close so you guys can see both of them now I didn't bring down any foundation to my neck yet my hands are a little dirty so it's going on my shirt so far I'm liking this side a little bit much better because it's more on my skin complexion more on the yellow side and the other one is more on the dark side I like it I really do like this side so I'm just gonna put a little concealer under there you know just to brighten up under the eyes in with my Charlotte Tilbury powder as always So let me know in the comments below what foundation you guys prefer. If it is the original foundation or the new one. This is still more as my actual shade. I mean like skin wise. It just look like skin. But we're gonna continue with the face. I'm gonna go in with this powder here from Charlotte Tilbury. I know, I've been using it a lot. I'm gonna just bronze the face a little bit. Okay, so this is how both of this foundation looks. So the original foundation, which is this side, is a little bit more on the red side. New one, the undertone has, they changed the undertone. I could tell because of the packaging. Now I do like this side because it's more on my, like it looks more like my actual shade. I can't really tell which one is which. No one can even tell like if I have both of this foundation on, but I like both of them. I think both of them is the same. They perform well. So I just want you guys to see what both of them looks like. Even though it says it's luminous matte, I don't really see any luminous in there. So I just think that it performed the same way as the original foundation. That is just my personal opinion. Now, the only thing that is different from both foundation is the undertone. This is the original and this is the, this is the new one. Okay. Two foundation. They are full coverage. I'm sure they will last 24 hours. I saw Huda Beauty. Uh, she did review on that. I don't know where I think, I think I saw it on Instagram and she said, it's not transfer. Girl, it's transfer. I don't know about that. It's transfer, okay? I'm happy I decided to do a comparison of both of them. If you have this foundation, you don't need the new one. I'll be straight up with you guys. You don't need it. The stick is a little bit more lighter than this shade. I want you guys to see, like the undertone is different. It's like way different. You guys could see that. On this side, my face look a little bit more natural. My skin just look a little bit more natural. This one just look like I have a tan, okay? But I still do like both of them. I've used this a lot over the years. So if you wanna try out the new foundation, why not? The undertone is different, as you guys see that I shown you guys. And if you have the original, you really don't need the new one. It's just not something that you need. So if you prefer the original foundation, Huda Beauty have it on her website for $28 right now. I think this is more for like my summer shade because I do get darker in the summer. I think it looks really, really nice on my skin. It looks like my actual shade. Let me know in the comments below what you guys think about this foundation. Which one do you prefer? Do you prefer the original or do you prefer the new one? I would like to hear what you guys have to say. Please subscribe to this channel and share this video. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. Thank you guys so much. See you guys in my next video. Bye guys.